This is for the skill tree level two on vault. We have a handstand to a flat back. So bounce up, get as close to handstand, finish in a flat back. And then over to bars, start with a handstand always. And here it's a full handstand against the wall. Walk up the wall or cartwheel to handstand. And once they achieve the handstand, we're gonna count one, two, three, four, five. And that meets the requirement. Now on bars, we're gonna do the pullover. And this can be assisted or it can be by themselves, but it needs to be from two feet, finish in a front support, straight arms, feet under the bar. Next is a back hip circle, casting from just above horizontal, circling the bar to a front support. Very good. And then cast, and now we just up it to horizontal. So the hips leave the bar, but the feet want to make it to horizontal. And we'll have three of those casts. Then we're going to up the regrips to five. So the form on this skill needs to be knees together the whole time, bend to straight. Regrip. That's right, and have them look at the green mat when they swing back. And they can jump off frontwards or backwards and finish. Then to beam, we're gonna go, go and start with the same leg swings, only now the expectation is going to go up and the leg swings are more to horizontal now. Front to back, three on the right, step forward, three on the left. Now, we're gonna do single leg hops, just walk to the end of the beam, and we're gonna put the right foot up and hop halfway down the beam, and then switch legs and do the left leg, working on nice, straight and tight leg at the top. Alternate split leaps. The goal here is to swing the leg forward and point the back toe. Working totally on feet and legs, not so much how big. Mountain climber step in to handstand. The legs do not have to close, just get up on top and finish in arms in front middle. One more time. At this level, it's easier to control body shapes when the arms finish more in a front middle position. Now we're gonna do mountain climber to handstand and the requirement is just on the low beam, but they can do it on the high beam. So starting in the mountain climber position, cartwheel to handstand and finish. And then the regular cartwheel should have done those in reverse order. Step in, arms front middle. Very good. All right, now for the um, floor, we're gonna start on floor with a split leap. And keep it the same, um, coaches. If they're a righty, the right leg is in front. They go right, left, right, split leap. Do that one more time. So you say, what are you, right or left? Right, right, left, split leap. Very good. Okay, now moving on to the rolls, or the handstand hold first. So kick up to handstand. Try to go one, two, three, step in. Arms all the way up at the end of the handstand. Now connected rolls. Go down there and turn around, allocate. And she's gonna go front roll to straddle roll to finish with a tuck roll to stand up. Straddle and finish that by tucking and standing up. Very good. Handstand front roll. They may bend their arms into the handstand roll. So we go mountain climber, handstand, front roll, up to tuck and finish. Very nice. Back extension roll to push up shape. 
Nice, solid shape. If possible, you can see keeping the arms straight is nice. Front cartwheel, mountain climber, cartwheel to step in. Arms can finish in front middle, and then they can go up. Either front middle or arms overhead is fine. Now the round offs, we want to work on the shape. So we're going to work mountain climber, round off, arms to front middle. So we have that nice shape. Now we have the back limber. Hips lift as you go back. Very good. Hold that position and kick over may be done on their own or assisted. That's your level two curriculum test.